We've seen uh, Marcus miss the last four and, and, and Zampa miss the last three. Is that just the management of workloads heading into the big tournament? Yeah, so Zampa, um, not as big a concern. He's as, yeah, so as you said, like more a sort of workload management. Um, he did pull up sore from the second game in the ODI series, um, but nothing significant. Marcus Thorne is um, a little bit different. Uh, he's got a slight hamstring complaint at this stage, so that's why he missed the practice games. And, and he'll be touch and go for, for the first game against India. So we've, we've got the main session today, um, and then we've got another hit out tomorrow. So uh, he'll go through his work there, and um, we'll see whether he's available for selection game one. But at the moment, uh, yeah, he wasn't fit and available for those practice games. Just on Marcus, when did that hamstring injury occur? Uh, so that happens after, I think it was the Mahali game. Um, so he pulled up a little bit sore from that. And then, yeah, further investigation obviously led to that being a, a slight hamstring. Um, and then he's just rehabbing. And as I said, we touch and go for game one. He hasn't certainly been ruled out of that, um, but we weren't prepared to risk him in those practice games. So he's been probably slow played a little bit um, with a view to these next couple of days being really important for him to, to press for selection for game one. And we'll see how that unfolds. How's Travis tracking and how often are you getting updates? <laughs> we'll get updates from Trav pretty much every day. Um, he's pretty engaged with the group. Uh, official updates that they'll sort of happen, I think it's around sort of the, the 11th or 12th of October where there'll be another checkpoint um, with how he's travelling with that sort of bone healing and that'll probably give us a lot more information as to the final time frames and, and when he potentially can join the group. But until we get that information, then he'll, he'll remain at home training and sort of prepping his body as much as he can um, back home.